All right. Hey, what is up, everybody? Just so we can tell that everybody can see, everybody can hear. And we're going to be getting started. Hey, what's up? Glad you all could make it. Hopefully you're having a great day. I've been having a good day. It's been a good Monday here at the Blind Wave Studio. All right. Okay. Um, let's see. We are going to be jumping right back into the story. Um, I still have the, the pall, the threat of going back to the spawn of Ogdo. Um, I'm still waiting for the right time. Who knows when that time will be, but I'm still waiting. Uh, before we get started, I don't want to lose it here. Uh, we do have a super chat from Awesome Osman. Uh, R.I.P. Carl Weathers. He's the best high magistrate in the galaxy we'll ever have. Yeah, that, uh, that news, that news hit us right before stream on Friday, and it affected me the whole night, man. I love Carl Weathers. I'm sure we'll be talking a lot about him, um, in our next Badonka Gonk, but I just remember just such a special moment of being at Star Wars Celebration in Chicago, I think. It was either Chicago or Orlando. It might have been Orlando, maybe. I'm not really sure. Either way, it was like the first big panel for the Mandalorian. We had no idea what the Mandalorian was. And they brought out, you know, they, they had, they're bringing out the cast. And I just remember when Carl Weathers came out, we had no idea. And I just looked around at the guys. I remember specifically Rick just being so excited. And it, it can be hard to get him super excited for Star Wars sometimes. And that was just, I don't know. I always just kind of remember that that moment and how excited I was for that guy to enter into a franchise that I love that much. It was really special, and he really made his mark. I mean, how many of us, when we think of Mandalorian, do we go, Mando? Because, I mean, his voice will forever define that, that, that show and the jump into TV for Star Wars. Good stuff. Yeah. And, uh, I'm excited too because on, at least on the channel I, I'm not going to say excited it's not the right word to use when we're talking about someone that's so recently passed but Aaron had only recently seen Rocky and only got a taste of Apollo Creed and he hasn't he hasn't seen the good stuff yet so hopefully we'll be starting uh, Rocky movie reaction sometime soon again but anyway uh, yeah hell of a thing alright so let's go ahead and jump back into Jedi Survivor I'm looking forward to this all weekend. All right. As you guys know, I'll try to keep up with the chats, uh, especially Super Chats and, and Twitch stuff, but uh, I am going to be jumping right back into the story. So, yeah, we ended back here at the Gorge site. Uh, I saw my man over here. Um, Let's see, was there anything we wanted to look around here? I mean, we came out over here, I think. I'm trying to remember this elevator here. Ah, I thought I saw something here, okay. And now we can open this, or I'm sorry, we can I guess it's an open. It's still opened. Uh, ooh. Okay. Nice little secret here. Sweet. Let's get this, definitely. There's something here. Um. Okay, so I wasn't really paying attention. I just was gonna go up there and assume, hey, some more force ability or something. No, this is one of these challenges. Oh no. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's see how hard it is first before we commit to this. But okay, uh, I did not want to start like this. Okay, the force is with us. There's nothing that we can't do if we stay in the moment. In the moment right now. There are three bosses in front of me. Can Cal do this? Well, we're going to look into the future, get a feeling if Cal can do this. Show me future.
didn't get anybody with that. No. You know what? I don't feel bad. We got one down, but I don't I don't think I'm ready for that one. <laughs> the echo hasn't faded. I guess that didn't work. Uh that's a lot of work. You know what? I'm not ready. I I, I haven't even begun to start getting back into the zone of the weekend and being good at this game. My my fingers are cold. Uh okay, so let's see what we're gonna be going into today. <laughs> that's really fun though. I definitely gotta do that. Uh, let's see. We need to head back to the ship. So let's get back one this <laughs> this meditation circle over here and work our way back. I need to center myself. And I know I don't use the uh, the slow technique very much or whatever, but I just it feels like cheating sometimes. I don't know. I know that's not necessarily correct, but. When I get desperate, I'll do it. All right, let's continue on with the main story right now. Um, actually, let's go ahead and go up to the cantina because we do have new characters and conversations available. Let's do that first. Kitchen looking good. Gonks are charged. Welcome, welcome. Make yourself What's up, home? monk? Let's find ourselves some just talking. See if anybody's just gonna talk. And the searching river is parted by the blade of the stone. What blade? What stone? Which is sharper, stone or water? I wouldn't fight a raider with water, if that's what you're suggesting. But is the river's course its birthright? Is this stone do its form? Oh, I thought you had all the answers. Shh, pay attention, Dana. I think she's talking about some treasure. <laughs> treasure. I love the song in the background here. Uh, okay, I don't want to miss anything here. Um, let's see. We had, uh, Toasts, Master7 say, So would you say Cal cheated death by using slow to escape Order 66? Well, <laughs> I know what you mean. It is kind of funny. I mean, he did kind of cheat death there <laughs> a little bit. Um, I don't know. I'm, I, I, I get your meaning. I guess I just enjoy the way that I play. I'm not, it's not a commentary in the way anybody else plays it or anything. I just, I like to play the game like that, so... Um, it's never on the forefront of my mind, I should say, slow is. Like, it's always something I'm like, oh, yeah, but, yeah, I'll do it when I'm desperate, but I don't know. I just don't like to use it all the time. I want to make it special. The Order 60 moment is special because it's not used all the time. How about that? <laughs> all right, let's talk. You two getting your fortune read? Trying to, uh, but we can't get a straight answer out of this one. Say it again, will you? On shores of silt, a river winds. A bank of guilt, a broken bind. Mm. Oh, I get it now. She's saying there's a big score to be had in some silty river. Ah, uh, you only hear what you want to hear. It sounded like a warning to me. One of them, the ominous ones. Mm. What do you make of it, Cal? It's dangerous out there. I trust my own instincts over a fortune. See? Kid gets it. 
<laughs> Who ever made the score of a lifetime by being more careful? Good points all around. I wonder if that's a, a clue that I could find and try to get some treasure. How you doing? How you doing? A lot of prospectors around here. Have you ever tried your hand at mining prior, right? Once. I found it. Enlightening. Some prospectors invited me to join them on an expedition. We descended to the mines. But when my back was turned, they fled. They ditched you? Damn. Yes. What a sniper. Alone, I calmly walked through the darkness. Trusting my intuition, I found another exit. And the prospectors? Dead. Coraco attack. If I had chased them, I would have perished too. Let this be a lesson. Always go your own way. Hmm. Wonder if Tulet has some measure of. I mean, I know everybody has the ability to use the force, but some measure of sensitivity when it comes to their uh, their fortune telling and their reading of the moment. Hey, we're thinking of plugging fresh energy cores into the dam to dredge your gorge. See if we can get them working again. Not a bad idea. Where'd you learn to do that? Yeah. An old friend of ours, top-notch engineer, had a winning smile too. Okay. That he did. Good friend to have around. You'd think. Guy shorted us on our cut after a big take. So, Grok may have left an anonymous tip with the authorities. Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, that is kind of harsh. Pretty harsh for someone who shorted you on a few credits. He tried to put his thumb in our slice of the pie. And our cut? Huh. That's non negotiable. There's some folks don't deserve a second chance, especially not mm. the greedy ones. I'll keep that in mind. Gotcha. Mm. Wonder if what he's talking about is the ability to put something where those like blue energy sockets are that you see on the map sometimes. I don't know. What? Hey, listen, now they were partners. Partners, huh? Partners. Just associates, best buds, call us whatever you will. Point is. Our relationship is an investment, and we've got bigger fish to fry than these raider hex. I'll get to those bounties, but if my friends are in trouble, they take priority. You're gonna get killed with that attitude, Cal. But on a set level, I can respect it. Yeah, we're gonna need to do bounties at some point here. I'm still kind of excited to get this. I mean, the story's just so good, I want to do more, but I do need to do some bounties. Definitely. There's Mr. Popular. A bouncy hunting droid named Rez is stomping around the forest array. Don't bother yeah. squaring up. Stay light on your feet and you'll dance around that rust bucket. Okay. Rumor discovered. Find, find Rez. So what happened to your smuggling operation? The Galactic Empire. Not long after the end of the Clone Wars, the Empire cracked down on my shipping operation. It ruined everything. Many of my associates saw the relative safety of the huts, good riddance. Most of them were snakes, anyway. But some of them... ...lost people I didn't expect to lose. Yeah. I'm sorry, Moran. Yeah. It's rough. No, I'm sorry. I seem to have forgotten asking for your pity. All right, then. Cal, I've been meaning to, uh... Well, I was a little curt when last we spoke about how my shipping operation was shut yeah, down. Yeah, a couple seconds Don't ago. Don't worry. I've heard worse. I really did lose everything, you know? And everyone. That's what brought me to Koba with what few wares I had left. The monk lets me keep my things in the back room. Go on. See if anything suits your fancy. Not like oh. anyone here has credits to spend. Anyhow, I shouldn't take my troubles out on you. Thanks, Moran. You keep your things in the back room, like here or like my room? Oh, this room! Show me your things! Oh. 
New music track. Okay, cool. Scan. Drea. Old friend of Moran's. Moran's possessions, a few scattered valuables, and a crate of textiles comprise of what remains of Moran's criminal career. The bevel of Moran's data pad faintly bears the name Dreo. Dreo. Okay. Hmm. Oh, we found the back room. Get you another brother? Oh. I'm not in the mood to drink. Didn't you hear the news? Now snatch Z back from that raider base. Doesn't change things for me. Empty pockets. Empty spot beside me. Can't help you there, Big Wheel. But let me know if you'd like me to see to that empty glass. <laughs> You'll do, Monk. Moran's pretty down right now. I kind of want to keep talking to him. I saw your things in the back room. Mm -hmm. You'll have to forgive the more tasteless ornaments. Some of it used to belong to Dreo, my Dreo. partner. Dreo, okay. Ghastly sense of style. Another outlaw? Not when I met him. He was running a perfectly legitimate port in Rhodia. Allowed me to use his docks for my shipments. No questions asked, supposedly. But we got to talking anyways. Sounds like a nice guy. He was the genuine article, all right. Probably why things didn't work out between us. See you around, Cal. See you, Moran. Say, Cal, would you like to buy my guide to Kobo? Not I don't really. think so. <laughs> Good, because I haven't written it yet. But okay. if you want to know something, I have all sorts of tips for Kobo visitors. Okay. Like what? Give information out for free. Come on, Cal. The frog's got to make a living. What do you want? What? I'm really busy, Cal. Oh, my anyway. God. He's trying to play me. Glad the place is getting more popular. Do you know about the bile mall lurking in the mountain? Bile mall, yeah, I've heard of those. They seem peaceful, but when disturbed, it will charge and trample you. Its thick hide makes it resistant to even the strongest weapons. How would you approach it? Mind your feet. Its spray attack will leave pools of acid on the ground. Good to know. Thanks. Okay. Got a new rumor there. Salutations. Salutations, Mosey. <laughs> but that Mogu you took out had quite the stench. Ugh, quite. Range with your nose, my mama always said. We once had a feral canifant terrorizing the ranch. Just a menace. Destroyed our barn. Twice. Twice. Canifants cover their own tracks, see? Crafty buggers. Practically impossible to find. So how'd you track it? We reversed our vaporators, pumped the air full of moisture. When it's humid, smells get a lot of... Mm. Well, more pungent. We'll be able to find it then. It long before we caught the scent. Clever. Ain't it? We all got five senses, Cal. I figure we might as well use them. All right. How can we apply that... To our play style. Um, well, I can't smell. Though Cal can smell. Maybe he'll just let me know. Uh, Carl Kraus with the super chat over on YouTube. Here's some happy news to shy away from Carl's passing. Survivor won best video game score at the Grammys. About time for some recognition for the series. Yeah, uh, I actually didn't hear about that. Uh, that's really, really cool. I'm happy for the team because, yeah, there's some great music in here. Uh, and not just the uh, diegetic music like we have in the cantina here, but it's all over the place. Well, you know, when you first walked in here, I was getting ready to throw you out. Oh, funny. I remember asking myself, am I going to be the guy who gives this Letero his second prosthetic arm? Oh, yeah, you go ahead and try. <laughs> but seriously, you've done good by us. Watching out for the kid. It's like you. <clears throat> Excuse me. Those tears in your eyes, Grace? No, no, they're not tears. What are you kidding me? No. It's probably smoke or something. Someone smoking in here? No smoking! <laughs> I got it, Grace. Right back at you. 
And if you ever want to get that arm modded, I know a guy. You, got so you know a modder? Oh, yeah. Ah, let me think about it. Okay. I like Bode. I feel like he really fits into the team well here. Pylones is drawing a crowd. Yeah, it could be words out that I'm the best cook this side of the Hidian Way. Hidian Way. Oh, what do you know, BD? You've got no taste buds. It, things tend to go a little salty, but that's oh, not too bad. Are. Both told me everything. Both pistols blazing. A real crack shot. Straight out of the hull of it. <laughs> Easy, Captain. I'm just trying to debrief. Debrief? Ooh, you hear that? This guy's a pro. How come we never debrief, Cal? <laughs> Simmer down. You enjoying the spotlight, boat? Hmm. Like an Imperial cavity search. But I've got to admit, it's great to see everyone excited. Let's catch up later. Watch yourself out there. Monk, you got anything? How about a bit of refreshment for bringing Z back safe and sound? Oh, yeah. Gosh, of course. I'm good. Thanks. Oh, well, why don't you send a drink boat's way? Wouldn't have been able to save her without his help. All right, but I still owe you one. Heritage coming back safe is the talk of the saloon. Something charming about that old gal, wouldn't you say? <laughs> All right. Oh, uh, yeah, we do have a gardener up on the roof, too. That's right. We should go. And there's more people up here. Ooh, great. What kind of armor? Maybe we can go to Thundercat on Tatooine. Grab a Are you kidding me? Maybe a spatula then. Spatula? Oh, now we're talking. It true then? Nick that droid back from the Raiders, did you? Uh, I don't think we met. Yeah, who are oh, you? <laughs> Lass, sorry about that. Came at you like a rocker, I did. Call me Ha. He's a uh, Osician, I think, is the name of the species. Septoma, and Gulu, and Gido, and Old Tall, of course. But uh, she's uh, last. There I go again. Uh, Cal, is it? Right. This is BD. Damn fine to meet you two. Damn fine. Hey, mate. Uh, I had a data bank entry pop up. Har. The primary source of gossip and rumors in the local saloon. R has lived in the community for a long time and knows a little about everyone. Win the war. Yeah, he's uh, Mark Hamill's uh, character in Rise of Skywalker, right? Uh, Bulio? Is that his name? I think it is. Win the war. Always love the way Mark said that. Coward. Hey, Scuba. How's the water? I just wanted to thank you for lending me your tank. Plenty more space for plenty more fishes, though. Let's keep them all spinning, eh? I might have located another meditation mm. chamber, Cal. Where? Inside the valley silo. No one's been inside for some time, but there are rumors. Okay. More rumors. Hey. You too, Z. Should you find any data discs from my day, I'd be happy to decrypt them for you. I imagine there are many that remain lost on Kobo. We'll let you know if we do. All right. How you feeling, Z? Much improved, Cal. Now that I am far from that ghostly ship. It's seen better days, that's for sure. The same could be said for the entire galaxy, could it not? True. But it is heartening to see that some bright spots yet remain. That's why we keep fighting. Indeed. I must say, I see vestiges of the Order, my Order, in you and your companions. It is most heartening. Sometimes you know just what to say. That's really nice, actually. I'm sure Cal really needs to hear that. I'm busy, young Jedi. Um. You returned in one piece. You sound surprised. <laughs> you do have a knack for getting into trouble. Yeah, but Bode has a knack for keeping me on the right side of blaster fire. A useful quality in a friend. Be careful. Okay, she hangs out up here. 
Good to oh, see you still, yeah. How's Pylones treating you? It's adorably derelict and entirely unique. If this cantina were on Coruscant, you could quadruple the prices and still have lines out the door. Any luck with the data pad? Ask Dorma. She's working on it. Thanks again for your help, Gal. Don't mention it. Okay, we're gonna check. Interested Whoa. in the game of holo tactics? Oh yeah, holo tactics. Look at this one. What a cool design. Oh, I'm scared of this. I feel like this is gonna be awesome and I'll never leave. Uh, I really wanna go to the moon and, and see what's going on and uh, 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 no, not right now. No, I can't delay any longer. No, neat. This way. Maybe towards the end of stream. Someone will remind me later. All right, I have plenty more yet soil to, to do anything here. Wonderful. New seeds. Plant one. I'll share its details. Hi, Peely. So far, Kobo has been a welcoming home. And this rooftop's energy drew me towards it. You feel a connection to this garden? Yes. We will help each other grow. Looks like you've already started. Divines? Yes, they sprouted overnight. But there's so much more to discover. If you plant new seeds, I'll tell you all about them. But, much like healthy roots, do not overextend yourself. Grow the plants we have, and I'll clear more garden space in due time. Okay. Uh, got that rumor done. Uh, I'm gonna need to come in here. Maybe in my off time or like between streams, I might come in and try to plant a bunch of these. I don't know. I mean, it is planting something you guys want oh, to see. I was hoping you'd find seeds like that. Put one in the ground. I'll share what I've learned. Hmm. Excellent. A new species. Plant it. I'll explain it to you. All right, people in chat were saying do try at least a little bit of the hollow tactics. So uh, once the door opens, we'll try. Let's see. I'm scared. I have an addictive personality. Ah, our savior returns. Let me make a proper introduction. I am Bima Ook, and this is my associate, Tali Moon. As you can see, we have set up Ema a game of hollow tactics here in Pyloon Saloon. Okay. I'm Kel. Glad you made it back safe. I'd say the same to you, but it seems there is no doubt that you can handle yourself. I see you have a companion droid. They can add to your hollow tactics deck by scanning combatants. Ah, got it. The more scans BD collects, the more options I'll have in the oh, game. Oh, okay, that's cool. Exactly. Love that. Of course, there is nothing stopping you from playing right now. I've scanned a lot. Come to prove yourself. Hollow tactics. Select the opponent you'd like to challenge. Defeat each opponent to unlock unique rewards. All right, how to play. Spend your battle points to purchase units and place them on the table. A challenge lasts multiple waves. Losing a wave results in defeat, requiring you to restart the challenge. Additional battle points will be awarded each wave, and any unused points will carry over to the next wave. Win all waves to complete the challenge. Okay. Well, I've certainly unlocked some units, yes. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, who do I want to play? Uh, <laughs> I have so many opponents. Um... Let's play Turgle. Uh, okay. You'll never beat me. Okay. Uh, let's see here. We have six battle points. Stormtrooper. We got the commander. Flame trooper. Heavy assault. And a rocket trooper. For melee, we have these guys. We got some purge troopers. Um, I don't know if it's better to have one, but we should probably maybe have one ranged and one, if we can, melee. We only have six points, though, so we can we have to pick wisely. I'm going to go 
with the Stormtrooper Commander. And I'm not sure exactly where they're meant to be placed. But we'll put them the range. We'll put them on this side. That's three of six. And then a scout trooper commander. And we'll put them here. I have no idea if this is anything I want to do. But I'm doing it. I think. Oh, wait. Hold on. Oh... Okay, I don't have to pick stormtroopers. Uh, okay. Turgle. So it's a recording. When do I start talking? It's a recording. Okay. Let's not go Empire. Let's go. Ooh, I really want to do battle droids. <laughs> uh, um. And then we have fauna as well, which is pretty good. Okay, let's do this. Let's go with. Let's go with this ra Raider Grunt. We're going to put them there. And then we'll do a Stormtrooper Commander over here on the side. And we'll start. I don't know if it works. All right, my range is going well. Oh, we got a grenade. Look out. Oh! It's off the board. Oh, man. Okay. All right. Well, I understand the game a little bit more. Huh. Okay. I want to play again. I won. How do I turn this off? Let's do that again. Let's do that again. Let's see if we can do it again. You'll never beat me. All right. We still have... We have two ways. We have six points. Um... I feel like it's almost better to go one person with higher. Like, this shield trooper should kill, right? Let's try that. Commence! Yeah, he's getting in there. That's, That's one. Get the shield up. Oh, get your shield. And okay, Cal good. Has to be happy with that. Very happy with that. And Cal comes out on top. That's he wave one. Now, I didn't carry over any battle points. That is a part of the game I need to remember. And there's a purge trooper now. Okay, well, I have 12 battle points. There's a purge trooper. I feel like I need to counter the purge with a magna guard. So the magna guard's gonna go in here and slay, putting him right there. That leaves us with four points left over. Um, in which case, I'm going to go with... I don't want my range to mess up too much. Maybe we throw in what we can afford with a Shiverpede. No, not a Shiverpede. How about an Electrostat First Trooper? We can afford it. All right, let's do it. Let the battle begin. Hey, get in there, get in there. You coming from behind? That yep, yep, yep. Toast. Two on one. Let him stay back. We got purge on purge. All right, they're going one on one here. Yep. That's a hollow kill. Okay, two on one now. We got Things it. Are looking good for cow. Yeah. Takes the match. That is probably going to be a really fun game to play a lot of, and I don't think I should right now, but that's a lot of fun. <laughs> uh. Cool, cool. All right, we beat Turgle and got a shard. Nice. Oh, no, my high score. <laughs> Um, I mean, Grease gives us a... Oh, that's cool. A mustache from Scuva? Greaves gives us a cool, like, Bespin Fatigue jacket. 
More later. More later. I'm not doing it right now. Expand your forces. Scan right enemies you encounter well, on your journey. There's still more to take down when you're back. Awesome. That's so fun. Hell yeah. All right. Let's get going. We have business on the moon. Some more additions up here would be nice. I see the Wait. Uh, I jump off the wrong side. I did. Over here. Somebody over here. Yo. Hey, have you ever set your eyes on the canyon lift? Can't say I have. What am I missing? Impeccable engineering, smooth ascension, amazing durability, and treasure might be worth checking out. A new rumor. I'll look into it. Thanks for the tip. Got a lot to do, but I still want to wait until I can do whatever I do with those floating platforms before I really start doing more uh, investigation. That was a chest for a second. Okay. Um, first things first. Let's talk with people. Watch yourself out there. Not much to say. Be careful. All right, let's go. Where to go? Where to go? We're heading towards the Shattered Moon. They will be expecting us. Cal and I made it through the Luker Hulk, all right? You and I have different definitions of all right. I wonder why Dagon sent Ravis instead of coming here himself. That was some quick maneuvering. No more talking? What, what happened? What are you looking at? We're loading up. Okay. Sit down. We're here. Vulture droids. Vultures, oh no. Okay. Looks like Ravis has more separatist toys than we thought. Doesn't look like they spotted us yet. Okay, good. Think you can land? I don't know. The risky part's gonna be taken off again, and the last thing I want is to be stuck on this haunted rock. You guys build a second cantina. Franchise. Hey, how about <laughs> you save the jokes for later, Jetpack? I can hide the mantis. Last I checked, this ship isn't equipped with a cloaking device. Yeah. She did this during the Fortress Inquisitorious uh, infiltration. The vultures are right in front of us. Trust her. Trust her. Trust my witchy woman. <laughs> okay, that was impressive. We will drop you off. Good luck with Ravis. To you. Hey, kid. Hurry back. Jetpack, man the guns. Copy that. Oh, and I might need some of your blood. In case I get tired. <laughs> okay. Back here. Be careful. Cal, don't show up out of nowhere like that. You'll scare the salt out of me. You know this place makes me nervous. Could be danger anywhere. Anywhere. Watch yourself out there. All right, we're on the shattered moon. I think it's only appropriate to pick our fit for today's stream. We're gonna go to customization. I, mean, I still am really loving this, uh, at least this silhouette for Cal. 
Um, but maybe we put on something different, like a different type of jacket. What do we want to do? The vest is pretty cool. I do like this, but I want more colors. You know what? I really, really do like this look, but that doesn't feel Shattered Moon to me. The tactical is kind of cool. I might go with this to putting on the vest today. Those colors are pretty sweet. Let's pick that for now. And uh, I do like the pants, but we might just shift around the color a bit. This looks kind of cool. I think we might go with this outfit for today. And then we're also here, so we should make sure that we are locked uh, and loaded with everything. I haven't checked my perks in a while. I do have three in use. Block meter increased. Lightsaber throws, more damage. More damage with blaster. This is pretty good. Uh, let's stick with what we have for now. And then stance wise, um, yeah, I'm gonna stick with this now for now too. Cool. Let's get going. Just once, that's all I want. A Don't moon tell Grease, without anything. But he's right about this moon. Zombies, no Maybe. raiders, no anomalies, and nothing we ran into on Narshada. Is that so much to ask? Narshada. Let's catch up later. Anything else? I don't want to miss any more dialogue, and I might have. I think we're good. Let's get going. Okay, so we are in the same area as we were. We're gonna have a look and see where it wants us to go here. I mean, we could meditation sphere up here. Uh, fast travel. It does seem like it's pretty far away, so. Maybe we go ahead and do that, just to give us a little. What do you make of this moon? I find it intriguing. What's more intriguing? The abandoned science facility, the bizarre stellar anomaly, or the constant threat of attack? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm starting to get you. You can't fast travel from the ship's waypoint, huh? Okay. That's fine. Um, let's see here. So we could just, I mean, we can just do this. are locking this place down. Oh, not the droids. Poor Travis's uh, ship. He's headed for the tower. All right, then we're heading for the tower. Best way up is through the array. Trying to block his laser bolts. Didn't see it coming. Oh, 
impressively fast. Am I not just being down? Ah! Continue the assault. We got a runner! Don't think so! It's over! Oh. Maybe Centauri hit the compass in the tower. Only one way to find out. Wavelength honing controls. As the array beam reaches the emitter, several checks are initiated to focus the beam. Calibrated its wavelength before calibrating its wavelength before it is directed at a target. Uh, Toe says, Eric, for your information, the charm Marin gave is hanging off of Cal's blaster holster. Oh, yeah. The, uh, that one. Okay, cool. goes down This is the only way uh, oh, Okay, I tried to slow there at the last second facility on the moon it would save us bringing materials from elsewhere one-stop shop as the needs of the moon station became clear it was decided to house a fabrication factory on the moon itself to better facilitate any required maintenance Excited slash really scared to fight Ravis. <laughs> oh no! Man going fast. Okay, that heads back down that way. There'll be a shortcut from over there. Okay. 
Whatever Dagon commands, Rakeness will see it done. You wouldn't catch me being tossed around like that. Silent. Here. I've taken damage. Ah. It'll be over soon. Ah. Thank you. Got him. Oh my god, there's so many! You're afraid. I like your gumption. That hurt? Was a lot of fun i know i could have tried to like throw them into it but i, I really wanted to challenge cal and see if i could do it he did it <laughs> man that was fun uh. Woo! that was nuts Just making sure I look around and don't miss any opportunity. Oops, something over there. Yep, there was something over here. Sweet. Ugh. Ooh, duelist. Cool. Okay. I like it. Going with the one-handed sleeve. I don't have any colors unlocked, but I like it. It's cool. I'll have to make an outfit for that. I want to see the rest of the coolest stuff. Okay. Thanks for the hydrate, Lewick. Waking Giants. For centuries, the moon station lay dormant and damaged. Ravis and Dagon, however, are determined to breathe life in the facility once more. Hey, Cal. You there? I'm here. 
You all okay? We're managing. <laughs> no rush, but uh, hurry up and let us know when you're on your way back. Will do. Ionizing uh, calibrators. Although shrouded in some mystery, it is believed the array dispatches Kobo matter by ionizing energy fired through it. Stations throughout the beam chamber monitor the progress process. Okay. Most of that, but my ears ring a little bit whenever things are tense like that is. Only way up is ahead. And into another firing chamber. Yeah, one was enough. We're not done yet. I go through there, okay. Prize merchandise. Ravis prowls every hidden nook of the array, accessing its remaining viability and latent potential. Uh, 
Oh no, 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 no. Ah. Resistance reveals the path. Resistance, persistence reveals the path. Okay. We will persist. Tense. Let's uh, let's meditate, and I am quickly going to use the bathroom real quick because I'm getting tense. I'll be right back. Let's see, uh, Ultra, Eric, I'm gonna rewatch Fanboys tonight. How do you feel about that movie as a Star Wars fan? I love Fanboys. Uh, Kyle Newman, the director, yeah, very fun. Um, yeah, I really love that movie. Uh, I haven't watched it for a couple years now, too. Maybe I'll do a rewatch, Ultra. Okay. Uh, I actually didn't rest. I need to actually rest. Laboratory thermoregulator. To control tests effectively, the inner laboratory temperature is strictly regulated by a master control into the laboratory's atrium. I like to say laboratory. I don't know about you guys. Mm -hmm. uh. Okay, he's on the back of Gal, that makes sense. But doesn't okay, let's go. Let's keep going. Whoa. Jedi, you are nearly too late. I await you in the control tower. Reach me if you can. Oh, hell yeah, okay, we got a duel going. What's that? Can I use these? Oh, still can't do anything now. Uh, this way? <laughs> I feel like an idiot. <laughs> I 
Gotta be something we get, not just uh, a thing Cal remembers, I'm gonna assume. You should run now! Barely get me! See, I use slow sometimes. Ah! Quick, help me. I'm hit. Ah! Ah! Damn. I got stuck with my view there. I need to go and take out that ranged attacker, too. Okay. This is good. We can do this. different options here slice that there's a Let's thing where we can put something there there's something going on up here Let's see what's up here first i think it was just where all these enemies were okay no test so far has been successful dagon gara Oh shit! Something I do not. Hold on! I missed that! The plan. Two Jedi of the High Republic find a quiet spot away from prying eyes to discuss their purpose on the Shattered Moon. That is 
is not a comfy way to fall. Not at all. Where were you? There are so many enemies in this area. Alright, I'm gonna guess we're gonna need to clear this up once we uh, maybe open this. We have a containment breach. Get down. Disaster strikes. When catastrophe struck Kobo's moon, the laboratory was not spared. Personnel within the lab could only take cover and hope as their carefully curated experiments shattered around them. Well, this particle is definitely bursting out of that containment tank, so that ain't good. I got a super chat on YouTube, Robo67. I'm wondering, as someone who didn't read the Battle Scars book, has that helped your enjoyment of this game, or is it something I don't have to read? Um, I read it. I enjoyed it. You'll learn how Grease uh, loses his arm. But I must say, of all the Star Wars books I've read, I probably enjoyed it the least, personally. It's not my favorite book. Okay, uh, well. Okay. Hmm. Now I'm assuming I need to request a hint. Uh, I don't want to request a hint. Does this shatter? Ooh. But I can try to grab it here. I don't know if this is what I'm supposed to be doing. I don't think I can grab it from over there and throw it, right? I don't even know if it would fall if I got it on that platform. Well, it does, but... I'd have to be quick as hell to be able to get it down there. Hmm. 
Uh, I did an entire uh, book review on the book if you want to get my more in-depth thoughts on Battle Scars. It's just had some stuff that I thought was a little bit too much for Star Wars and for my liking. The clutch! All that tech on Kobo. Was it made here? The gadget we found in the stone spires. Think you can help here? You got this one, right, BD? See what Cree was up to. Find something? Find something, buddy? An operable console. Rendered inoperable by time or sabotage, the proximity of these consoles to the innermost laboratory nevertheless guarantees that whatever information they held was likely of the most sensitive nature. Workbench. Centauri. Dagon, what have you done? What I must. Stop. But you want what I want. Why else would you deceive the Council? You've lost your way. Surrender. And we can figure this out together. Come with me. It's too late for that. Such despair, Santari. Tanalor. You can feel it slipping away. My despair is for you. Tanalor has changed you. It's changed you as well. Tanalor changed you. The lightsaber's sick. Step aside. No. And I must go it alone. Damn, that's how it goes, huh? Centauri. Get a medical droid in here and prepare a back to tank. Damn. You what? Find? What do you got? Can you do something with those floating things? High Republic tech. Works with my grapple. Could help us climb the tower. High Republic tech. Upgraded ascension cable. You defeated Dagon, but didn't turn him in. Why? <laughs> Woo! Allegiance. In a forced vision, Cal witnesses Santari Kree attempt to pull Dagon, Dagon back from the dark path. After Dagon violently lunges for the compass, Kree severs his arm and calls a droid to repair it back to tank. All right, I think we got a new tool for exploration. Let's give it a try. Grapple. Oh. 
Okay. It works. Cool. Ravis. Nice. This is sweet. Okay, cool. Old L2 to perch on a grapple balloon for a short time. Hoping to get that chest up there. All right, let's keep going. All right, um, from there, where do I want to go? Oh. Can you go up? to get that chest. Yeah. No. Is it impossible to get that chest from here? Might be. when I go through this beam. Anything? Death. Got it. Okay. Well, I can get out here. Now I can go... Can I go up? Am I... Am I crazy? Where do I go from there? Or is that just... I have a feeling like I'm stuck. What am I missing, guys? I can get onto that one. I can get onto that one. I can see there's jumpable walls up there and more over there. Do I want to? I don't think I want to go down. I can probably get to that one over there, but that doesn't seem right. Get over here. Oh. Okay. What? Good job. Stabilizer beam. A series of modules ring the lab laboratory, feeding energy down into the array's 
initializing chamber. Maintaining a constant flow of energy is seemingly vital to ensuring the entire array remains stable. Okay, I can get over here. Okay. Well, I'm at least happy with that. Sweet. Can I get up to that one? Nope. Don't even want you to try to do that. Um, and do I just suck at using these? Maybe. Oh, hey! I just did like a jump. Okay, so if you don't, all right. Got it, got it, got it. Hold on. Initiate the jump. Ah, uh, okay. Well, I can go... I get some height, but I don't know if I get enough height off of that thing. Um, yeah, I, I, I might just be dumb. I cannot use my intuition to discover which direction to go in next. Like, can I get up there? I, I don't mind a back seating right here. I don't want to waste time. I'm sorry if I'm missing something, but I, I don't know what to do next. I mean, there's balloons there. Balloon there. You gotta be able to go do this one. And then what? Oh, up here? Oh, okay. Okay. Alright, I just wasn't looking like that. It didn't seem like very good level design to me. But alright, okay. Uh, let's go over here first. Get this. Cool. Let's get this data disk back to Z. Uh, when I say good level design, too, I'm not talking about, like, oh, yeah, these game designers don't know what they're doing. I just mean sometimes I'm not, I'm just not good at it. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. See? Sometimes I'm just not good. <laughs> okay. We're back up here. Now we should be able to do this. Nice. Okay, well, 
I don't know where my nearest meditation circle is, but here we go. Ravis. Jedi. Jedi. Why did you activate the array? It's been many years since I last took the life of the Jedi. Why did you activate the I array? heard you. Long ago, Dagon bested me in combat. Earned my loyalty. We fought side by side until the Jedi betrayed him. It took many of your order to defeat me. And yet, they dishonored me. Denied me a warrior's death. And left me to rot in a cage for centuries. So, it seems our destinies are intertwined. The demise of your demise. Our need to escape. And yet. Nothing has changed. <laughs> You're still just Dagon's servant. Damn cow. Time does not diminish my loyalty. I am much more afraid than Cal is right now. You can only serve yourself. Where's the compass, Ravis? I owe you nothing! Jedi! If you want that knowledge from me, you're gonna have to fight for it. Okay. Very Square nice. up, Cal! Ooh, it's a long. Oh! Okay. Gotta learn his movements. His range. My range. Okay, we made cover. Okay. Oh! Yeah, he's a Gendai. Oh, cow. Oh, damn. Oh! Got a little more respect for Mr. Kestis, aren't you? Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> For 200 years! I won't disappoint you then. Okay, my hands are sweating. Feel that 
Oh, oh his range is getting. Oh, man. Oh. Battery low. Oh, okay. Damn. This is tough. This is fun, though. We'll, uh, I'll plug the battery in here in a second. Okay, I'm not... Oh, man, how far away am I? I'm not super far. Okay. Uh, I'm going to continue with this loadout. Yeah. So fun to watch, and I'll watch it over and over. I've been waiting for this. It's a little more exciting than Obi Wan versus Dirge. <laughs> what a great idea for a boss. Centauri Kree's observatory, as Dagon suspected. I have opened the way. He goes there now. I defeated you. Fight with me. We can take on Dagon together. <laughs> I will not. Uh, I don't get his thing. Okay. After all these centuries. 
I still dream of Tantalor. I had hoped to see it again, but... Oh, that is not to be. This Dagengara stands in your way. You don't have to do this. Only one of you will reach Tantalor. Jedi, give me my warrior's death. I should go. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh. Damn. Damn, damn. A warrior's death. Ravis tells Cal how he came to be captured and imprisoned by the Jedi hundreds of years ago. The memory is a bitter one, as the Gendai code dictates honor from battle, an oath of service if defeated. Although Cal attempts to convince Ravis to join his cause, you, that would have, could you imagine Ravis on the Mantis? Ravis is tired of servitude. He demands a warrior's death and receives it. Damn. I'm gonna real quick check uh, my difficulty. Nope, I'm still in Jedi Knight. I'm just sweet. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I can't be so confused trying to get up here and then try to brag about how well I did in the boss fight right after. Can't do it. All right, got a new perk called Centered. We'll have to check that out. Okay, I thought that was a force thing, but it's not. Grease, you there? Cal, I don't know what you did, but those vulture droids are making a hasty exit. The landing pad's clear. I'm gonna bring the man in now. Copy that. We'll be waiting for you, kid. It is nuts. Just how much distance Cal can cover. Maybe Ravis was right. Dagon abandoned the Jedi code. Now look at him. Consumed by his obsession with Tantalor. Is that different from what we're doing? Yeah. Don't worry about it. Thanks for having my back. Um, Ryan Abara with the super chat. Congratulations, Eric, on defeating Ravis. It took me two days on my Grandmaster playthrough to do it. Aha, that was so much fun. Awesome. Space right there I haven't visited. I kind of want to. Let's see if we can get it before we leave. Meditate. Give ourselves a rest. And then we'll go fast travel. And... Where's it at? Does this not show... I guess it doesn't. I, I think it's still over here. Let's just go here. Travel. Nope. 
button. Okay, it's to the left back. Oh, I gotta do this again. Woo! That's okay, okay this. BD. We'll find another way. Damn! Can't open it. It's also one of those things up there, too. Jedi has been sniffing around, and I ain't letting him through. Give me one good chance. Skill point, yay! Man, Ravis wasn't too bad. Those guys are a challenge. Okay, uh, I need to bring that up there. Okay. I need a stem, buddy. We need to burn this and get through there.
Ooh. Slice and control droidicas. That's sweet. Nice. Okay. Um, there's a red door that I can't get to. There is a green door there. down here. See if we can get to it. I don't know what it is. Could be cool. Uh, it's through this, though. That might be hard to get to going backwards, but I'll try. this. Make sure we get it. This one might be difficult. I might not be able to do this one. Yeah, I don't think I can. I don't think it's possible. Um, right? Can I get back up there in order to get to that? I don't know. That's the only difficult part. What do you guys think? Can I do it? It's a shortcut? Oh, okay. If it's a shortcut, I don't need to worry about it. I was kind of worried it was going to end up being other parts of that uh, duelist set that I haven't found uh, more of. Okay. Well, if that's the... If that's the way, let's go back up here to this... To this one. Let's stop Go for a moment. Here. We'll rest. We'll fast travel. Okay, let's go. A blaster, better run a little faster. No pie, a lone saloon, a location shattered moon. Uh. Hey, look at that, he ain't dead. How you doing, kid? Cow. Whatever you did up there, sure kicked the firebug nest. Ravis is gone. Yeah, that'll do it. So let me guess, back to Kobo? Yeah, I think so. Back to Kobo, okay? Say, uh, jetpack, give me a hand up here. Yeah. Hmm. 
strong cow. Interesting. I can't make any sense of this place, Cal. Be careful. Not now. I need some time to think. Cal? You eating okay? Keeping up your strength? Do I look like I'm wasting away? Well, no. I mean, you look fine. Listen, just let me fuss, would you? I appreciate you, Grace, but I'm fine. Might not be able to cook like you, but we were able to find food. Yeah, yeah, I saw what Seer ate. I don't trust a Jedi's definition <laughs> of food. What do you think about a good stew for supper? Everyone likes stew. Baby, we got a stew going. Ah. R.I.P. Carl Weathers. So, Marin. Night sister of Dathomir. Just Marin is fine. All right. I thought the Night Sisters were all gone. They said the same of the Jedi. They did. All right. Let's see here. I feel okay, so like next. Going back to Kobo is the way to go. Because not only does is that where the story is taking us, but now that I have seemingly... I, I don't know, but I, I don't feel like I have very me. many more uh, uh, exploration actually, uh, speed buffs. Question. Need to clear my mind. Hmm. Okay. You're brooding again. That easy to read my mind? It's no Jedi trick. Just pay attention. Shattered Moon. I saw Dagon confront Centauri. He was so consumed by Tantalor that he completely lost his way. Hmm. What pushed him? I fight with the Empire these last few years. Let's just say I don't want to end up like him. You are very stubborn, but ambition does not drive you. Huh. I just don't understand why she didn't see the change in him before it was too late. They dreamed together and suffered together. Shared dreams, not so easy to wake from. Is that what troubles you? Losing yourself. Yeah, I think he's asking you to look out for him. Yeah. A little. If you ever stray from your path, We will guide you back. Love the remix of the Fallen Order theme. Doubt! After defeating Ravis, Cal wonders about what code he follows. Now that the Jedi Order is gone, he worries that he could lose himself to obsession. Marin assures him that should he stray from his path, his family will bring him back. 
Yeah, well, hey, I mean, the temptation of the dark side it only works if there's a possibility that it can happen. You know, story-wise. I have to believe that Cal could turn if he goes too far and he needs people around him. I think that's why he's been so uh, afraid about losing the people around him. All right. <sighs> The Bedlam Raider Code. The Bedlam Raiders are led by Ravis, a Gendai warrior who imparted upon them his strict warrior's code. At its core, the code promotes the quest for freedom won through ever greater power, and that death is preferable to subjugation. Although many of the Raiders themselves do not adhere to all of the code's principles, it is nevertheless a binding force that keeps Ravis' irregular army Unified. Ah, uh, no more codex. Damn. Uh, super chat, Lord Harbinger. Hey, Eric, been a fan ever since your Mass Effect streams. Love how you explore the lore in your games. I don't do that. Thank you, Lord Harbinger. That's very nice. Yeah, I love, I love lore games more than I love playing the game. With Ravis dead, the Bedlam Raiders have been wounded. This makes them dangerous. They weren't exactly harmless before. Yeah. No, they were not. I will look after the outpost. The Raiders may strike if they think we are vulnerable. I'll be back as soon as I can. I know you will, and I will be waiting. I was kind of hoping that I would beat them, and then they would all like suddenly be on my side because I beat their boss, but that's not part of the code, I guess. Don't you have a mountain to climb? I gotta hand it to you, kid. Things are looking better than ever. And you wanted to sit this one out. Oh, well, count on you to prove me wrong, Cal. When we were all ready to fold, you never stopped fighting. But we can't stop now. Yeah, I know, we still got a lot of work ahead of us. But you gotta remember to stop and appreciate how far we've come. Is Bode still on? He's probably outside. Or at the Cantina. Nope, oh, he's over here. By his headhunter. I'll catch up with you. Gonna fire up the Z95 for some good old fashioned air support. Thanks, Bode. See you up there. This is it. The home stretch. Can't stop now. Bode, I need air support. All right, so I need to use my saber flow throw. I suddenly forget how to do my saber throw. Oh, thank God. come from okay did i get the thing that was hiding in this thing did anybody see i don't remember if i did or not yeah okay l1 and then triangle why did it not work whenever i was fighting here here it is here it is let's take this to domas Huh. 
Interesting. Okay. Never been up here. That's the roof there. Uh, Carl Krauss, Super Chad. I'm looking forward to the next Badonkagonk on the 22nd. I'm in the middle of rereading Catalyst to prepare. It's better than I remember. A great tie-in. Yeah, we're going to be pl uh, playing. We're going to be reading... James Luceno's Catalyst in the next Badonkagonk, and that is a uh, novel about Galen Urso. And I'm going to guess uh, Director Critic as well. Yes! Finally! Great find. Alright. So, I say, what time is it? I'm kind of saying we do a little bit of exploration at this point now. What about you guys? Let's look around. Um... Meditation chamber, there are rumors around. Let's pick a direction and go there. Let's go to this area over here. Pretty sure I've been up that way, but I haven't been down this way. I don't think. No, I... I feel like I've been this way, but maybe I just haven't entered into this area. Like the actual... What? There's no secret here? There definitely should have been a secret behind a waterfall. Oh, there's a secret behind this waterfall. Ooh, is this a challenge? I think it is. Let's see what it is. Ooh. What? What's this? Fraction resolve. Use your skill to reach the goal. Okay. Okay, it's switching. Visual indicator for that. Okay, so it's whenever I jump. Interested.
<laughs> Dang it, this is kind of hard <laughs> to think things through. Uh, I gotta use my 4D brain here. Keep messing up. I need to focus. I need to go left. I need to go left. Sorry, everybody. My brain doesn't work like this. time I come to the edge of that. Is it? I make it? Completed. Okay. Damn, that was hard. Okay. So it's not just uh, combat challenges. It's parkour section challenges. Well, those are going to go hard. I had to use my skill points. Damn. Enjoyed these in the garden. These are now a lot more Not doable. Shard. Yes, cool. Got a hydrate. This has been here. Okay, we got that. That's good. That was a forced tear. 
There's some... These green ones here. Open path, okay. Yeah, I, I'm definitely thinking about using the rest of the uh, stream guys to explore Kobo a little bit and just have some fun and enjoy the world. I mean, I think taking out Ravis was pretty good for today's stream. <laughs> At least I feel pretty happy about it. Here, there seems to be somewhere we can go. Shit. I gotta get up there. Definitely a shard I haven't got. Look at this. Sweet. All right. Uh, anything else back? this way that I haven't done. There's some red back here. Some areas back this way. All right. Absolutely have a sense of progression here. All right, uh, let's see. Where do we want to go? Uh, we can probably make it up there. All right, so let's meditate. Focus. Fast travel. I wish on this screen you could see the. Uh, the markers again, because I get confused with all these extra lines around here. I don't remember which one it was. I think it was like here, right? Bygone settlement? Yeah, I gotta do my skill points. You're right. Okay, it definitely has an entrance behind there. And then there's one over here. Have I done that green entrance yet? I don't think so, right? Green means you've gone through it. Yellow means you haven't. Red means you can't. 
All right, we're going to go out left here and around and go in through here. I haven't done... Wait, is that right? I guess... Hmm. was loud. We might just let this one pass. Nope. We know. We can't make that jump. Um, go make this one. Yes. I always forget about that. <laughs> oh man, there's one over there too. Okay, this is a dangerous place. I need help. Let's get this. Huh? Did you do that? Wait, what? No! Technological betrayal. The prospectors, grown used to the aid of their roller mines, were surprised and horrified when one day they suddenly turned against them with catastrophic results. Okay. What's that noise? Oh, there's those there's roller things over there. Okay. Damn you, directional sound! My only enemy! Ah. 
Get out of there, cow. Okay, there's rollers there. the droid because here e3 v e3 e3 v e3 e3 v e3 i didn't even notice the that it was a boss battle. A custom modified Droidica unit with enhanced offensive capabilities and heightened belligerence algorithms? What is also noteworthy is the droid has been reprogrammed an additional time, overriding Ravis's original rewrite with new logic and loyalty protocols. Hmm. Can I scan him? BD? I want to use him for hollow tactics, BD. Ah, okay. Oh, not looking good for the prospectors. Glad you're excited. Well done. Truth. Ilias, brother, I am sorry. You cannot stop me. I do not want to do it, but I am right. I crack the cubes. You'll see. No more now, brother. No more. Hmm. Gift of Fire. I brought the new roller mines to the others, and they were delighted. He has become interested in the planet's strange cubes. However, so I will need to split my attention. I admit they are compelling. The planet's strange cubes. More health. This is good. We're, we're really filling out our health and force and stuff like that. Okay, uh, that's it for here. We got more areas to check. Let's keep going. I'm having a lot of fun. Oh. This just closes it. Yep, that's okay. Yeah, I'm going to assume the cube also means the High Republic exercise chambers. But you never know. All right, uh, we're going to head straight ahead, I suppose. We'll Thank you, buddy. Now. Sorry, I just Yoshi'd him. I'm gonna need one of those, aren't I? Just to get up there. What's the button I pressed to call for them? R1.
shard. Let's trade it at Doma's shop. Awesome. Uh, let's go straight this way. I'm probably outrun this thing. I don't think you can get up here. Well, yes, Prospectors didn't stand a chance. Biomob borrow. The biomob can be a vicious creature, but mostly in defense of its territory. They find shelter from the elements, but only build nests in order to give birth and rear their young. Any interloper who would intrude on that space is therefore fa fair game. Mm, excuse me. Fair game. <laughs> uh, I intruded on its nest. That's not nice. Okay. Did I just kill it for no reason? It did not die for no reason. I need to go over there. Oh. You gotta let me go. Oh, yeah. Why should we? Uh, I can be of use to you. Yeah, 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 that's it. Whatever you want. I'm your frog. Oh, oh we'll see. Boss is looking for something. Find it, or we'll find you. Turgle makes a deal. Turgle, having crossed the ruthless Bedlam Raiders, attempts to take shelter in a nearby cave. Failing to shake his pursuers, however, he begs for his life, making a dark bargain. He will later come to regret. Okay. So I think I just went in here uh, the opposite direction. Or no, can I jump over? I don't. Ah! A Rodian! That's Gara. quite an arsenal you've got there. Arsenal? What? Why do you ask this of Gara? Business is none of yours. I'm not here to make trouble. What do you plan to do with all this? I present as gift. Ravis. Great tribute, yes? Tribute? You mean you want to join the Raiders? Join the Raiders, yes. No more prospecting, no longer other saying weak of Gara. Much glory and blood of Ravis. The Raiders are dangerous and not known to strike deals. Danger, eh? Gara gorge self on danger. Gara live for thrill of kill. But you are not killer like Gara. You do not want to join the Raiders. Gara doesn't want to join the Raiders. Uh, unreliable. The Raiders are unreliable. It's too dangerous to bargain with them. Yes. Raiders are not to be trusted. Too dangerous for Gara. No, no. Deal is off. Too risky. Contraband. Here. You take. Gara no one. All right, then. Good. Ooh, Mountaineer Jacket. 
Hmm. Okay. Okay. I like the hood. I want to see some different colors, but that is really cool looking. Are you just going to leave all this here? You take contraband. Gara gets rid of rest. Too risky for keeps. Eh, eh. You here still. You take contraband. You leave. All right. Got it. Okay. Is that everything here? I kind of felt like this big boss monster that was guarding this place would have something more. Right? Water's flowing under that. I don't really see anything else. This was the nest. Obviously, it wanted you to jump up here. From there, you get onto the ceiling. I just went over there. From there. So I think that means you head over here. Like, is this... Are these just, like, funguses here? Okay. I was just trying to be thorough, but I honestly don't see anything else. No dealings with Ravis. Maybe it was just the uh, the outfit then. Oh. Know, I'm assuming there's something else here because I saw a lot of messages deleted. <laughs> I know that's cheating, but. Light on the wall here. Nope, can't cheat that. All right. I don't know. Maybe I'm just dumb. I don't see anything else. I was looking for like a baby one of those creatures, but I don't see it. All right. Where else are we going? Let's see. From here we can go f uh no, those are red. We can go this way. I got a there probably fine trophy. I'm not really sure why. Yeah, that's right. Help! 
Now be me. Out of stems, too. All right, let's go through here. Might need to find a meditation point soon. more against a roller mine yeah i'm gonna find one around here uh where would i find a roller mine? okay to have one follow me in here. I'm looking. Mogu Den. Generally, though not always, a mogu will incapacitate its prey before dragging it back to its den, where it can be preserved and devoured at the mogu's leisure. The mogu of this cave has clearly hunted well. Okay. I don't have any steps. No stems at all.
Okay. I was like, what did this get me? Geonosian audio sensors. Cool. Okay, we need to get back and heal. Ah, I panicked. <laughs> I wanted to go right here. This seems cool. Have I been here before? That's dark and deep. Is ammo. Okay. part of the deal you know we came to this rock together we we're supposed to leave together oh well i ain't gonna forget you you know that and i ain't leaving oh domo doma long-lived matriarch of the outpost did not come to kobo alone however the planet's unforgiving nature did not spare the partner she traveled with now only this unassuming grave and Doma's memories are a testament to their existence. Sad. All right, I know I need to heal. Is that me just dying? I think that's that sound that seemed like me just dying. I don't know if I'll be able to survive this fall. I just thought maybe there's something cool up here. Damn. Yay! <laughs> we made it. Yeah. Awesome. And rest. Okay. Um, well, let's keep going. I say we maybe end the stream with a little bit of of the hollow tactics. Oh. I should probably spend skill points. <laughs> I think that's probably what I should do. <laughs> I have a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Okay, let's do skills. Almost seven. Skills. Here, I'm going to go use the bathroom real quick. I'll do skills, and then we'll do a little bit of hollow tactics before we end. So we're not quite done.
Hmm. All right, well, let's look at survival. BD1 stem canisters refill force meter. Cow's maximum life is increased. Block meter refills faster. Okay, those are pretty good. Dash strike. Hold L1 and then press square to dash and strike a target out of normal melee range. L1 and square. Okay. Aerial dash strike. Sounds good too. There's a charge throw. And an aerial ace. Does more damage and staggers enemies hit by it. That's good. Yeah, okay, cool. Uh, on the double, there's Rising Storm. Hold triangle to perform an attack that pulls enemies in a small area. Okay. And then a controlled throw and multifold reflections. Hold L1 right before blaster shots connect to reflect them back towards nearby targets, okay? Double orbit. Let's get this. Ooh, okay. Cool. All right, we got three points left. I haven't done much on dual wield. Or I need to work on those, but honestly, I'm not super concerned right now. Increased duration of slow. Uh, maximum force. Swift focus increases force recovery when performing a successful precision evade. I don't use slow much, but I probably should. Okay, that's cool. Ooh, okay, R1 and to lift for telekinesis. That's, I like that. Nice. Nice, okay, cool. R1 and triangle. All right, one skill point left. Um, I need to use confusion more, definitely. Let's go ahead and get it. Maybe that'll get me to do it. Uh, no, I, I I see that you can preview. I was just reading. It's fine. They're not super complicated. Uh, what else? That's all my skill points. Good. All right. Uh, let's go check out some hollow tactics. Hollow tactics. Let's see if we can beat people. <coughs> now, here's the question. Do you have what it takes to best the rest of these tacticians? Let's go with Grease. All right, the three waves. He has two chickens and a stormtrooper to start. Um, we got 16 battle points. Uh, wow, okay. We're going to go with an electro. No, hey, we're going to do a secure. No, 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 no. Yeah, OK. Electro staff. Put those in the front line. Let's do a droidica. Put that back here. All right. I. You know what? I think this might be a dream team. Let's try. Go! Oh, it never stood a chance! Okay, chicken's down. 
and then he killed himself. Good. Yes. All right, that worked out Very really well. Good. Okay, 18 points now. Um, we got two troopers and two baton guys. Biomom might be pretty good. 12 points. Do I think they can take out a Biomom? Let's have it there, and let's try to keep six points for the next one. See what happens. Combat! What an attack! Watch out for the grenades. Uh huh. Okay, one more, one more, one more. Oh, it died. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, that's fun. It might just be too big. How much do I earn? Okay, let's fight Grease again. Let's try to save up some battle points. So those chickens aren't very strong, but they will attack you pretty, pretty, pretty good. Um, so I definitely feel like I need a melee guy, guy, guy in there. Let's do one stormtrooper over here. And one staff trooper over here. Let's see what that does. Advance! And okay. it's a goner! Nope. Okay, so the, the huh, chickens immediately took both of them out so fine. quick. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean there's no actual credits involved? <laughs> oh, okay, so the chickens are a lot harder than what the first round made it seem. Okay. Alright, uh, what do I gotta do here? So... Let's see if this works. Let the battle begin. That takes them out, but then he gets oh, to have so long. Farewell. an attack phase for and both of them. It's off the board. Run, run, run! Oh, the why'd you stop? Oh. All right, I, I probably, I probably needed to have a range to take care of the trooper. How much do I earn? So, you think you can take on old Grease? Alright, you are meant to draw the chicken fire. As are you. As are you. And then I'm going to use you. Back here. Let's see what that happens. Go! Oh, it never stood a chance. And it's off the board. Obliterated. No. I lost, but we, we did beat it. Okay, now we have 24. I'm kind of feeling these sentry droids.
I'm kind of thinking uh, one of these. One of these. And then two guys. No, one guy back there just to try to get some shots in. Let's try that. Advance! Oh, he oh, he just right he in. just blows up. Okay. Well, I think I. Oh, it never stood a chance. Damn. Kestis okay. has got to be contemplating his choices after that. I know. I'm sorry. Okay. Let's do stuff. Let's go different. Uh, what's some strong ones that we can go? For? Let's get. Hopefully, I don't have more kamikaze battle droids. Um, let's try. I mean, I didn't go wrong with these guys last time, kind of, right? Let the battle begin. Oh, no, they just so killed. They killed. They killed them immediately. Wait, what do you mean? There's no actual credits involved. Damn. I suck at this. <laughs> Those damn chickens. Um Well hey, okay, so the shield guy probably won't get hit by the chickens. Which means I could just spend What if I spend one here and one here? Let's try that. Advance! Get your shield Advance up, guy! That unit is toast. Now that's All right, I won, kill. but he did not get his shield up. A strong round for Cal. All right, carry it over four. 22. Staff and blaster. Let's go one here. And a droidica over here. Let's see what happens now. Okay, Droidica's good. He stopped next to that for some reason. Good, good. The Droidica's definitely useful here. Super useful. Okay, I feel good about that. Alright, so now we have a uh, security droid. We have 16 that we can go for. I'm going to say we definitely throw up one of these guys. Now we have four left. Um, damn. Okay. Monster. Let's just throw one of these guys up. Put him here. Let's see if it works. Combat. Okay. And it's a corner. That unit is tough. Okay, hell yeah, we did it. Oh, it never Yeah, okay. He wins again. Woo. Reward. Get this pilot jacket. What? Wait, wait, hold on, wait a minute. Why don't we raise the stakes a little bit? He's trying to hustle me. Your opponents will be here when you return. I wanted to see the new jacket. Yeah, very Luke. Bespin fatigue, but it's a cool jacket. It really is. 
Ooh, kind of X-Wing like here. Kind of liking this color for Cal. Kind right, of cool looking. All right, let's try one more before we end. Time to play a game of hollow tactics. All right, those are colors. Scroll, puck, mustache. Let's go for yeah. Look at. All right, 16 points. I think that it's almost a mistake to just not use Droidicas at this point. So that is a B2 they got going on there. And then four left. I wonder if a Droidica can take on these guys. Let's see. Let the battle begin! And it's off the board! Okay. Oh, it never stood a chance! Ah, no, okay, he's got the rockets. It appears your strategy wasn't up to the challenge. It was not up to the challenge. I foresaw this victory. I don't know why the B2 was shooting his teammates, but it was. 16 points. Try this. Combat. Those damn grenades. That unit is toast. Ah, yeah, they are toast. Now that's a hollow kill. Completely toast. Okay, let's I try some different. Let's try some different ones. This will be a true contest of mine. Die quick. Come on, get him! Get him! That unit is toast. The roller mine did nothing. <laughs> from Cal, see him through to the next round. <laughs> uh, but that stormtrooper did pretty well. A lot of good cover fire. Uh, we got 23 points now. So maybe we throw one here and one here. And then let's do a melee. My purge trooper isn't too bad. Let's try this. Don't go on the grenade. Oh, Cal can't be happy with that round. I'm not I'm not very happy with that I one. 
This will be a true contest of minds. Get him, get him, get him! Shoot him! And it's off the board! Damn it. I foresaw this victory. Yeah, no. A true contest of minds. I still like having these guys in the corner. So maybe let's keep one and then go melee with the purge trooper. Let the battle begin. Quit stunning the, the first time you attack. Kill. All right. Well. Oh, he's dodging all my attacks. Oh, Damn it. So long farewell. <laughs> we can't all be winners. Uh, I foresaw this victory. I know you did. This will be a true contest of minds. All right, good coverage, good coverage. Go, 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 go. Kill him! Uh. I'll tell you what, it seems like B2s are the way to go. I foresaw this victory. This will be a true contest of minds. I just don't think melee is the way to go for this one. Try this. Advance! Okay, he's running around. That's good. He's still going to get blown up, though. B2 versus B2. Damn. The odds have spoken, I'm afraid. I don't think melee is the way to go at all. With those grenades, it just doesn't work. Contest of minds. The grenades just fuck you up. Why don't my guys throw grenades like that?
sweet. Oh, it okay. I really like the way the purge trooper worked That's there. The That's nice. We need melee right now, I think. A Magna Guard might be good. Oh, grenade, though. No. Oh, okay. Get him. Now yes. Hell yeah. Hell victorious in that round. Okay. Okay. I say we stick with the winning strategy of this guy over here in the corner. Now we only have six points left. It looks like they're all ranged. I want to go with you. I'm going to go with this. Let's keep him back here so we can get a shot off before we go into it. Hopefully he doesn't get grenaded. Let's see. Alright. Okay. He's doing his best. He's doing his best. Get your shots off. Get your shots off. Okay. You, you can do it. You can do it. Yes. Get him. Yes. Cal Kestis proves himself superior in the final play. Alright. That's a fun game. Alright. We got some colors. I am lacking in clear strategy. And there's more to be discovered, too. Oh, man. Okay. Guys, that's super strong uh, minigame right there. <laughs> that's a super strong minigame. I want to play more. Uh, and I will. We'll do a couple at the beginning of Wednesday stream. And then maybe do some more exploration around Kobo. I'm kind of feeling like a real nice exploration stream next week, I think. I'm sorry, not next week. Next stream, which will be Wednesday. <sighs> okay. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I had a really good time, and uh, we'll see you back here next time. Uh, I need to switch this before leaving. Um, thank you guys so much for being here. I I'm having such a ball with this game, and uh, it's so much fun. So, All right. We'll see you. Bye-bye.